So ladies and gentlemen, it's time to leave the hut. It's time to hide. Your main events of the evening. The first is for the Battle Arena National Championship. Introducing first, fighting out of the red corner. Please welcome Ross Gallagher. Ross in the black and red. White. Nash in the black and blue. Oh. Ross starts out very low. Shoots a double edge straight away. Gets straight it. in there, he wasn't messing about. Obviously wants his fight to the ground. Go straight in side control. Keeps the legs sucked out. Starts off at the ground and pound. Danny trying to land shots from the bottom. Ross looking for that mount early. He's been the full guard. And these guys are just slugging it out. Yeah, the both position. guys just trading shots there. Ross's corner, corner for the posture. Ross seems happy enough to just sit here and land some ground and pound. Not looking for the pass, just looking to sit there and beat his man up. Keeping his head low, keeping the punches short. Yeah, Danny's a little bit stuck here at the minute. Yeah, Ross. His head up against the cage and he doesn't seem to be able to move his hips out to, to get out of this position. Yeah, Ross is doing a good, good job of occasionally stacking him as well on his neck, coming up onto both feet. A good head position there for Ross. He's rolling his forehead underneath uh, Danny's chin. Keep his head in one position. Yeah, he's staying busy as well. Giving the occasional some really good shots from the guard. Danny's getting out in the open now, so he should really try and move his hips and get, get the fight back standing, or at least move his hips and try and get a submission. Yeah, maybe open his guard, try working for something. He's, he's not going to win the fight like this. He's opened up now. Yeah, let's see him get his back to the cage and try and stand up. Just sitting here, he's losing the round. Yeah, he almost got yeah, a reversal there. there but Ross has got a good base. Staying strong on top.
Ross really just grinded in there. The referee's starting to take a look now. Ross is staying busy though. He's got, they're, they're little shots, but they're... Yeah, I'd like to see him posture up and land some bigger shots. He's doing well to keep the fight in this position, but it's, it's not the greatest spectacle at the minute. But obviously, uh, Danny Meanwhile is still not trying to get to his feet. Referee again. A little bit of a warning there. Looking to scramble a bit. Nearly looked like a sweep. Ross getting that looking, pass now. Yeah, he's looking to pass. Doesn't get past the shin though. Down to the cage as well. Well, Ross definitely winning this round. Big double leg to start it off with. And uh, he's kept yeah, Danny he's... in the same position and just ground him out. Yeah, Danny's going to have to make some pretty drastic changes to make sure that doesn't happen again. Looks like he's not got much off of his back. So he definitely needs to try and stop that takedown. Nash definitely going to have to look to make some improvements in this round. He's going to have to try and fight off that, that takedown early, I think. I think that what that round's proven is that his, his game off his back's not really got, isn't really going to uh, worry uh, Ross. So I think he's definitely going to have to fend off that takedown. Maybe if you can time an uppercut or just, or just watch out for that sprawl. If Ross comes out with the same game plan as before, takes it early. Yeah, he's got Danny thinking about it. Yeah. Danny needs to pose himself far more than that. When he's stiff and jolty like that, he's, he's there for the takedown. Oh, nice Danny flip. Rolls him there. Danny, top position there. That's see better from see, him. Uh, see if you can see the sit out there from uh, Ross. Danny looking to get to the back. He's yeah, on his back. back take. Just blocked though. Ross on top again. Same same position as we were in in the, uh, yeah, in the first gonna round. Ross just uh, fire punches him from this low posture position now. Steps over into the half guard now. Ross looking to improve his position. Looking for the side control as well. He's got it now, so let's see what Danny does from here. He's trying to scramble. Well, I'm put a fly, manages to go over into the mound. Good see position Ross from, from here. He's in a very dominant position now. He's gone to low mount. I'm back into regular, although Danny turns him nearly, very nearly gets it. Shots coming through now, yeah. heavy. Need to see more of that from Danny now. He's got to reverse his position quickly. Ross is going to be heavy from here. Danny just does not seem to have much of an answer for this uh, off of his back. Yeah. He's just holding on. I'm not seeing any kind of uh, hip bumps or bridges. No hip escapes. Yeah, another big bridge is out. Looking to take the back. Going around to the back. See if it's he can a hang big on to it. Around if he can get it. He might be on that back if he could rock. He wrap up that rear naked. He's early. got it. He's got it in. 
He's on the back. Let's see if he can stay there. And now it's done his turn to move a lance from ground for him. pound. Danny, far more aggressive with the ground and pound than Ross was. But Ross yeah, is just going to try and he's, he's really him out of off. good position. And Ross is almost out of this. Yeah, Danny's really got to come up if he wants to stay on the back. Ross manages to scramble back on top. It's a good position for Ross now with that underhook. Yeah, Ross is a real smuggler when he's... to land uh, some ground and pound here. He's a real smuggler when he's on top. He's, he just gives Nash no room to move his hips, no room to sit up to him. He's got both his underhooks and he's kept them the whole time. Keeping his head low, his hips low. And he's just waiting for his time to pass and take mount as well. Nash has got that right underhook now, see if he can use that. Ross comes up with some punches. Well, Ross tried to pass and then they got reversed. Got goes back into the full guard. guard. Really going into this third round, uh, Nash is going to have to make some pretty drastic changes. Yeah, at the, the minute he's just trying to punch from, from the bottom position, I think he's getting frustrated. And yeah, I think he's looking for more of a tear up. And he's right next to the cage, he needs to just open his guard and just start to wall walk and get back to his feet. Yeah, if that's where he wants to be, he's got to work for it. Third round, uh, Nash needs to be timing an uppercut, throwing some hooks. Yeah, absolutely, he's two rounds down. Clearly yeah, throwing no kicks. In terms of uh, Ross, just needs to keep doing what he's doing. Had a, had a very small slip up there uh, at one point during the round, but they managed to pull it back well. Third and final round for the belt. I think there's no doubt Ross Gallagher's up to uh, two rounds. But if he can just do the same for the third, uh, I'm pretty sure I'll have the belt. Get going into the third. See if Nash can do anything considerable on the feet. Goes for the hook. Yeah, Shot Ross on again early. looking for the same thing. Although this time Nash has got an underhook. Yeah, that's better from Danny. He's, he's gone for the guillotine. He's, guillotine. he's rolled the roll. with it. He's ended up on top. He's gone into the mouth. This could be tight as well. It's under the chin. He's got a good squeeze. Yeah, he might have this. It looks tight. He's cranking it. He's just got to stay on top. But he gets swept. Yeah, that's unfortunate. That was a good position for Danny to try yeah, and turn this around and finish. Could have been Danny's last chance. He's still holding on to it now from Psychotrop bottom, which is which is no good. Can't quite see, but I think Gallagher's head might be out now. But another big turn. He's still got some fight in him, but he's giving his back up. He's not giving his back up. Yeah, this is a great position for Ross. Both hooks. Brown and Pound's gonna start coming in. There comes the rear naked. Let's it go. Ross is going to soften him up with some punches first before coming in under the neck. Yeah, you can see once that rear naked choke, he's just going to land a few now punches. Now flattened him out. Credit to Nash though, he's still moving. He's still moving. Ross is just all over him though. He's going for that choke now. He's going for the choke. Looks like it's under the chin. He's squeezing. And Nash ends up on top this time. Slips into the mound. He's still fighting. And he's Gives up his back. back. Nash is still in with a chance here. If he can, if he can flatten out, get a rear naked. This will be a real turn. Can get this. Can't he's quite the see the position. But I think fight. he's going for the choke early. But he's just given up. Distributed his weight way too far forward. Ross is landing big knees now as well. Big 
good shots there from Ross now. Ross tries to hop over to the mount, doesn't quite get it. One last big bridge from Nash, doesn't get it. Ross back into full mount. Posturing up now, he's going for broke. Final round, may as well leave it all in there. Yeah, I think Ross would like the finish, but Danny's definitely tough. He's hanging in there. Another big bridge. Gotta uses it to pass. Again, Ross's got to be careful he doesn't get um, reversed there. Uh. Yeah, Ross just needs to stay tight. He's made sure there's, there's not uh, no more reversals come out. He leave himself in a bad position in the last few, uh, few seconds. Some big knees, some side control, or half guard even. Both guys are tired, and I think we're going to see the round out in this position. Yeah, three fours is uh, exhausting, especially for Nash trying to fight against uh, yeah, this he's, kind he's of style. Some bad spots, but from Ross. But he has, he's hung in there to the end, give himself a chance. Ross, look at Ross, finish now. He's looking busier, now. he's looking busier. The last few bursts from Ross. Yeah, Danny's still just trying to, he's, he's frustrated, he's trying yeah, to punch from punch, the bottom position. He's punching off of his back, which is never, uh, never too much of a good idea. Another big bridge, see if Ross can take the arm yeah, bar, he's he out of Danny's come out. But Danny needs to finish the within 10, 10 seconds. seconds. See if he can pull out something miraculous. I think he's going for the win, naked, just too late. Oh, something happened some there again. Hope. I think there's been a bit of confusion.